My name is Zi Hao. What is KKK? <laughs> Very good. <laughs> and does anyone know what Ku Klux Klan? Don't know, I mean, does anyone does anyone don't know what's Ku Klux Klan? Seems like some of them don't know what's that. Okay. So Ku Klux Klan, they are um, they used to be a political group in back in the 1800s in in the US, and till today, they are considered one of the terrorist group in the US. They are, in, in another term for them, they are called the White Hooded Order. Okay? Right. So, but this White Hooded Order, they go around to actually, um, they use violence to actually preach what they actually believe in. And violence in the sense of killing people or whatever form, torturing. So, for this KKK, or rather the Ku Klux Klan, we have them in Singapore. And as a political group, they might be in white, Sean. <laughs> they might be in white, just saying. But this KKK actually exists in Singapore. So the first K represents, any guesses? No guesses? No idea? Keen. 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 Oh, Keen. We say Keen. 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 Okay, um, Keen. most Singaporeans have this. Keen. A key? Kiasu. 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 I know, yeah, I know. Kiasu. Kiasu. Oh my god. Korean knows what's that. Very good. <laughs> Can we give a hand for him? <laughs> yeah. okay. Does everyone know Kiasu is just being uh, being selfish in, in a way? You're being you you don't want to lose out to someone else. Or maybe in the in the uh, English idiom it's about it's called cat in the manger. It's a it's a fable, there's a fable to it. I can explain to you after that. Okay. <laughs> Time. <laughs> okay. So the second one. I know, I know. Kiasi. 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 I know the third one also. Kiasi. It means, literally means a fate to die, a fate of death. But in other words, it's, um, it actually just means you're timid to do things, you're timid to actually break through your boundaries, break, break, get out of your comfort zone. So, for the last one. Who? What? Kiam <laughs> Siap. <laughs> I thought of that too, but it might fall in a bit of Kiasu in a way. Okay, so the last one. It's not Kaki. That's me. <laughs> okay, it's. Okay. Kaya. Kaipo. 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 For Kaipo, it actually means uh, you're a you busy body. You're poking your noses into everything else. Like, for example, um, let's, just, let's just let Ricky off this time. So everyone's like, hey, Ricky, how, how's your relationship? Uh? Uh, <laughs> no, it's not. It's not. It's not. No. Yeah. Okay, anyway, this KKK is just not really a form of terrorist group in Singapore. But they, they actually, um, they actually hurts, uh, hurts to be a Singaporean in this way. Some people define it as uh, being proud of being kiasu, because you don't lose out in education, you don't lose out in anything. Yeah, so it actually, it's actually not a very good way to actually express yourself to be kiasu, kiasi. Or Kepo, or maybe Kiam Siap. <laughs> okay? But actually, we in Singapore, we have um, a lot of movement to be kind, to be charitable, to help other people in our, in our life, not just doing your own thing, being selfish. We're actually, we actually supposed to reach out and actually help more people. So, what I actually believe in, that the three Ks, First one, we should we should transform into kindness. 
I think being kind to everyone is a is a must, and no matter enemy or your friends, you should all be kind. And Mother Teresa once said, she once said that if you're kind, if you have kind a kind words to a person, it might be very little, but it actually echoes more. It echoes out what you want to be, and what, and the person will actually feel feel good about it. Second. Secondly, yeah, see, we don't want to be limit. We don't want to be. Don't be. Don't be restrained from yourself. So we should actually try to be keen, not keen, <laughs> right? I mean, you should be keen on doing more things to venture out from from what you actually believe in. Break out of your comfort zone and try to be the best of who you are. Lastly. You should strive to be knowledgeable so that it makes you a better person and also it will it reflects much about you. So when you're um, when you're, in a way you're more when you're more knowledgeable, you're actually more refined, you're more calm. So if we could as Singaporeans we could trans transform from the, these three, the first three, Kyasu, Kyasi and Kepo, to be kind, keen. And knowledgeable, I think we will be better off as a person. Not just, not just. I mean, everyone will be better off, and Singapore or the world will be a better place. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.